Uh, well, Ooh, there's hotness sitting next to us. I don't know, That's yeah, really what it comes down to. And it's not the, the corduroy shirt, honey. No, it's not. <laughs> All right, 7-Eleven. Retired Bears cornerback, uh, cornerback is what I'm saying, Jerry Azuma, and current defensive lineman Israel Adonage played a few years together with the Chicago Bears, but they have something else in common. They both have charitable foundations. They're doing good. Mm -hmm. And they teamed up to bring you a laugh-out-loud comedy show for a good cause. What could be better than laughing your way into helping people? They're here to tell us all about it. A big you and me welcome back to Jerry Azuma and Israel Adonage. Y'all look good today. Water. Yay! <laughs> Got a soup. A cute really and to smell here. them because they smell Wait. really good too. Ooh, yeah, nice. Both of you. <laughs> Older with Zuma is very yeah. nice. Come on over here. Yeah, Jerry. Right, come here. Get <laughs> yes, <laughs> indeed. That's some wake you up this morning. All right. So let's focus and tell us more about the show. What's going on this weekend? Yeah, we have a laugh out loud comedy show. It's just going to be a, a great night to support our charities and and to support the youth in our in our community. And uh, we have some great comedians coming out, and it's just going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, who's okay? Tell us who's coming out, and are you guys getting up on stage? Because yeah. that was our first question. I was, like, I was actually thinking about getting on stage. Were you, Jerry? Like, uh, you should. You're I funny. Should. Yeah. Maybe I shouldn't. You know what? Um, get some liquid courage. We have some over there, <laughs> and just take it with you. Have you know just a little something to kick the edge off. I'll give it some consideration, off. Just tell one, two jokes, and you never know. That could be your, uh, your future. <laughs> I'll do it if Izzy does it. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> but who who is going to be up there though officially? Well, we're going to have uh, Damon Williams. We're going to have Tony Schofield, Brian Babylon. Funny. Um, you know, th there's just a whole uh, nice little mix of, of uh, comedians that are going to be there. So, What a great okay. idea. Now, why did you guys decide to team up on this? Because you both are both committed to doing work with your charities in a way mm -hmm. that, that doesn't, you don't always see happen. And so why did you guys decide to team up with this? Well, I mean, Jerry and I have been friends for a long time. We've been talking about doing something. You know, I know uh, all the great things that, that he does to support education and kids. Yeah. And, and uh, we said, hey, this is a perfect fit. He's, he's uh, been doing the show. So uh, <laughs> I said, hey, I'm, I'm in. It's going to be a lot of fun, and I'm pretty excited you about know, it. And it's also just a little different also. Uh, yeah. Because you know, yeah. there's a lot of different fundraisers out right. there. But we wanted to incorporate something that was funny, you know, something that was engaging. And we thought... A comedy show would be perfect for that. Yeah, because yeah. you know sometimes they're really boring. Right. <laughs> I mean, let's be honest. They're for a good cause, and you know that's why you're there, so you put up with it. But how much fun it is to have some fun while you're right. there. Right. right. So cool. Okay, wait, Israel, I got to ask you too about as long as we're talking about funny things. You have a, your, it's a comic book, or is it a series of what, what's coming out, and it's going to be an April? Yeah, at uh, Chicago C2E2, we'll be releasing uh, the Protectors. It's the story I created, and uh, yeah, it's just it's a comic comic series that we'll have. The first one is April, and we'll just kind of roll them out from there. Okay, but it uses, NFL, doesn't it use NFL characters? Like, as the, is, it, is that how you use it's them not, as a superhero? It's not NFL characters. Oh, it's, it's not. It's actually just athletes. So we have a, we have a football oh, player, we have a basketball, hockey, isn't that soccer. Cool? Right. You know, wait, and, so wait. And, and we're gonna put Zoom. Are you gonna have an Zoom? Yeah. The, the Zoom. <laughs> He's you know, gonna be the right. Zoom. Right. Oh my God, I love that. <laughs> okay, wait. Tell the truth. Are you one of those Comic Con geeks? Tell the truth. Tell the truth. You know, I've, I've been to plenty of Comic Cons. You know, okay. I was in San Diego. I've, I've done the C two E two here, the Wizard World here. You know, I enjoy I enjoy the cons, and uh, you know, it's just a lot of fun. If you've ever been to one, it's there's nothing like it. Yeah. yeah. Well, we've seen pictures. Yeah. So there you have. <laughs> Ask you, Jerry, because you uh, you won the Walter Payton Award right I when did. you were still in college, mm -hmm. and you know we a all long love time ago. what yeah. a long, a long, <laughs> five years ago or so. But you know, then you go on to play for Chicago after winning a Walter Payton Award. Like what? And you, I mean, both of you have so many accolades. What right. did that mean to you to win that award? I mean, it was really special for me because and then to live here. Know, yeah, just being you know? in Chicago. Like my whole life, I grew up watching the Chicago Bears. So, um, I, I grew up watching Walter Payton. Yeah, you know, he was my inspiration. So just to be able to get drafted by the Chicago Bears was like a dream come true. Right. Mm -hmm. It had to seem kind of mm -hmm. like almost prophetic looking at getting that, that award. And then you're like, right. wait and a then minute. And all of a sudden, like, you're at right. the Bears, Here right? I am. Well, while we're talking about the Bears, so I don't know if you want to make a comment or not, <laughs> but what's, so how are you guys feeling about this new coach? <laughs> are you guys <laughs> like, like it's going to be good. good. It's going to be good. Right. Now. good. Right. No, but yeah, a lot of people are really excited. And come on. Well, they, I mean, they should be excited. I mean, it's something that's going to be new. And, um, you know, expectations are extremely high. Um, you know, unfortunately, Lovey had to go because, you know, they just didn't make the playoffs. Yeah. And, and, you know, the management says, you know, it's time to, to make some changes, you know, and get back on track. And I think that they've made some good changes, you know, um, with the coach that they're bringing in. You know, we don't know too much about him. But, um, you know, all the things that I've heard about him is, is leaning in the right direction, especially yeah. with the offense. Because you're going to get a ring. Huh? Right. It seems like yeah. a ring. What do you think? Well, I real? think, uh, you know, like, like Jerry said, we all love Coach Smith. But it's in this business, you know, it's all about winning. It's all about championships. And, and uh, you know, this, you know, Coach Trestman, 
if you uh, look at kind of what he did in Montreal, I mean, their their offense was a machine. You know, they were a power so he, a powerhouse. So if he can bring that to uh, to Chicago, and, you know, yeah. it's, uh, he's also used to winning too. Right, right. You know, because he won back to back Grey Cups as well. But, and that's what motivates you guys anyway. I mean, is 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 the win? It's like that feeling that you get at the end of a game that you won can be like anything else. I'm right. sure. Gene and I are going to go to Vegas really quickly. So before you leave, could you just tell us who to bet on in the Super Bowl? <laughs> just who should we bet Off on? Camera. Israel. Who should we go well, with? Real go quick. With Baltimore. I got some Baltimore? Some, fr some friends on the Ravens. Okay. Is that how you pick winners? Okay, yeah. Jerry. Jerry, go with. I'm going with Baltimore. Also. Oh, Gene. Okay, okay. okay. Yes. we're going to Baltimore. All right, what's the over-under? Yes. Well, we'll talk about that after. <laughs> and the pack right. attack? <laughs> Go on and support these guys. Tuesday, January 29th, right. it's the Laugh Out Loud comedy show. It's going to be at Untitled, a great, great venue, 111 West Kinsey. Tickets are available at the website on your screen. We also have it linked on our, web on our website as well. General Mission, just 40 bucks. The VIP private cocktail reception is $85. Well worth it and for great causes. And if you want more information on either Jerry or Izzy's foundation, Foundations. Those sites are on your screen as well. And of course, we put the links there. Thank yeah. you guys. Thank so you guys much. for Thank everything you. you do. These aren't guys just play football. If you read, you know, what they've done for, yeah. for Chicago and for your charities, it's really admirable. Both right. of Thank you guys. You. Appreciate it's you. awesome stuff. And they're cute. They dress well and they smell <laughs> and good. And they smell too. really good. I mean, that's really oh, what is it's all single? about, right? Yeah. We have yeah. some friends we may or may not want to set you up with. Yes, indeed. We need all the stats before you leave, okay? <laughs>